So a nice video here to show you how to put assessments into the apps for all of your clients to record results themselves. Now, as you know, we have a very thorough assessment section, but those ones really are designed to be done online. And the idea behind that is to do that yourself as a Skype assessment with your clients. So they're very in depth with things like movement screens and postural assessments, length tension tests, pretty much everything you would want in a quality assessment. But as I say, they're designed to be done by you with your client over Skype and you record the results as you go. Now, obviously, certain things you will want your clients to record, things like weight, perhaps body fat percentage from bioimpedance and tape measurements, that sort of thing. So I'm going to quickly show you how to put those directly into the apps for your clients and how to do it really easily. So the first thing I would do is create a group. So come up to more client slash groups. Click on PTD groups and new PTD group. Give it a name. So I've just called mine assessments in app and create. You can then search for your group here and click on it. And that will take you straight into the group dashboard. Once in the group dashboard, there's add assessments here. This is the really big assessment. So leave that one alone for putting assessments into the app and just click on add coaching slash tracking. Come down to results tracking sheet and click on add. Now what that does is it brings you to this screen and it has track other results. On the action box, just choose view slash edit. And then it brings you into your results tracking sheet to add tracking. Now, I'll very quickly remind you that when you do it like this in the groups, you only ever have to set this up once and then you can copy it to all of your clients really, really quickly. And I will show you that in a minute. But right now, we'll just add some tracking. So we'll start off with a weight measurement and add. Next tracking we can do, pop some tape measurements in there. Again, edit. And you might want to have body fat percentage. And add. Now, once you've got those onto your sheet, you can just click here to add what you want them to record in that specific assessment. So for body fat percentage, click on add and you'll want them to record their body fat and choose units down below would be percentage. Now, if any of the units that you want to use are not in the drop downs here, you can just click on this green link here to add units. So you can have anything that you want recorded and add. Tape measurements, we may want to add a chest measurement and you would probably take it in millimeters, centimeters, or inches, depending really on where you're from or where your clients are from. So for this, I will choose inches. Again, if it's not there, just click on add units here and add. You may also want to do a waist measurement. Again, choose inches and add. So you'd add until you get all the tape measurements that you want in there. Then we come down to weight. You would obviously want to record their weight. And the units you would choose, again, depends where you're from or your clients from, it would probably be pounds or kilograms and add. So that's now all completely set up. That is your assessments that you want to go into the apps for your clients. I just very quickly go back into the group so from inside the group dashboard, you can schedule it and you can schedule it once and that will copy to every client. Click on schedule and add event. Click on days after joining. Let's say you want them to do their assessment on the day they join. So not days after joining. You want them to do it in the morning. So I'd leave it at 9 a.m. You could change it to earlier or later, entirely up to you. Event type would be update progress. And from here, you would then select results tracking. If you wanted to repeat it every week, for example, you choose every one week. And let's say your program is a 12 week program for 12 weeks. 
You can do this at any kind of regularity you like. It could be daily, it could be weekly, it could be monthly, and it could be for as long as you want to. In the notes section, it's a good idea just to make it very clear what you want them to record, so just write it out. So all I've written is please record your weight, body fat percentage, and tape measurements. So save that. And you will see that it goes on day naught as we click through the next week. It goes on day seven. Day 14, so there it is, scheduled for every single week of the 12-week program. Now, this is where it gets really, really clever in the groups. You set it up once, and that's all you will ever need to do, including the scheduling. So, click on Members. At this point, you can choose to add this content to any one of your individual members by clicking on them, to any members of any other group you have already set up by clicking on the group, or to all of your clients. So by clicking on that and clicking on add, I have 446 online clients and I could add it to their apps by just clicking that button instantly. That will also have the every single week schedule and that will be from today, seven days on from today and seven days on from them. So do it on the day that you want them to record their results, probably Monday, up to you. But now you can see how powerful this is because you can just drop it into the accounts of every single client instantly. Now, if you're adding a new client and you want this content to go into their app, then all you need to do is add clients. Put in your client's details. And down here it says add two groups. So from the drop down, you can select assessments in app. That's your group, add it. You'll see that the copy box is already ticked. So the content in that group will go straight into your new client's account. Click on save. And that client is now set up with their assessments in the app and in their schedule. So let's take a quick look at the app and see how it works for the client and how simple it is for them. So in the app, your client comes in and clicks on their schedule. What they will see is they've got update results tracking and the little note that says, please record your weight, body fat percentage and tape measurements. So they can either check in to say they've done it or they can view it and record their results. So body fat percentage, they can just record their results and save it. Tape measurements, they can go in and chest 34, waist 32 and save. And they can quickly do their weight and save. So that's it. They've done all of their records and they've saved their results and that will go into your alerts in your account and let you know straight away that they've done that and then you can have a look and see what their results are. You can also instantly send them a message from that particular page so that it's nice and smooth process and you can just congratulate them on recording their results and if they've got improvements from the previous week. So that's so that's really it. That's how easy it is to set up assessments to go into the app for all of your clients. It takes five minutes or so initially, but once you've done that initial setup, you can add it to all of your clients and you can add it to new clients instantly. And the assessments are straight into their apps to record any results. Now, if they want to see any charts or anything like that, they can click on down and there's three little lines. Once they've recorded three dates worth of records, they will have a chart. Any notes they've put in will be there and all of their records will be here so they'll be able to see any improvement over time.